The stock price of Trump Media closed down nearly 11% Friday afternoon, a day after majority shareholder Donald Trump saw President Joe Biden stumble through their first presidential debate. Trump Media, which trades under the DJT ticker, in pre-market trading Friday morning had been up by more than 11% in pre-market trading. But the company ended the day at $32.75 per share, a decline of 10.84%. The Truth Social app owner's share volume was heavy, with more than 24 million shares changing hands. Trump, the former president who is the presumptive Republican nominee, owns almost 65% of Trump media shares. The company's market capitalization stood at $5.8 billion Friday despite having meager revenue. Political observers and Democratic donors said Biden, 81, gave a dismal performance on Thursday night in his debate against Trump at CNN studios in Atlanta. Biden's speech was garbled at times. He also lost his train of thought, and his face looked blank with his mouth agape at times as Trump spoke. One major Democratic fundraiser told CNBC that Biden's performance was a disaster. This is terrible. Worse than I thought was possible. Everyone I'm speaking with thinks Biden should drop out, that donor said. Trump media stock prices fell more than 10% Friday afternoon after a streak of climbing in the days ahead of the first presidential debate. Hours before Donald Trump faced off with President Joe Biden in Atlanta, Trump Media and Technology Group share prices closed at $36.73. After people across the country watched Biden stumble through several answers and Trump repeatedly drilled down on immigration, the share price was up 8.3% to $39.78 at open. But by Friday afternoon, that fell to around $32 per share. Market volatility for the company behind Truth Social, often referred to a meme stock, is nothing new. Trump founded his social media company in 2021 after being booted from other major platforms following the January 6, 2021, riot at the U.S. Capitol. Trump Media went public on the Nasdaq on March 26 through a merger with shell company Digital World Acquisition Corporation, a special purpose acquisition company, or SPAC. The merger was announced in 2021. Trump's debut on the stock market was splashy, with Trump Media shares soaring helped partly by, and to the delight of, his supporters. But prices have fluctuated wildly since then. The stock price has swung from a high of $79.38 per share at the close of March 26 to its lowest close of $22.84 on April 16. It steadily rose throughout Trump's hush money trial, before starting a weeks-long decline after the former president was found guilty on 34 felony counts. That downward trend didn't reverse until the debate was just a week away. The parent company of the Truth Social app has been compared to GameStop and AMC. Like these typical meme stocks, Trump Media is overvalued compared with its peers, other social media companies, at least by conventional Wall Street standards. In May, Trump Media reported a net loss of $327.6 million in the first quarter of 2024 and brought in $770,500 in revenue according to a reportedly unaudited filing. Regulatory filings show the company was operating at a loss in 2023, making about $4 million in revenue while losing more than $58 million. Experts have previously told USA Today that meme stocks rely on attention. The debate, one of the most watched events in television, certainly brought that for Trump.